friends. Today I'm going to teach you how to make a between the sheets. This is a classic cocktail from the 1920s and it's very, very good. I'll tell you what's in it. The between the sheets consists of cognac, triple sec, rum, and lemon juice. Very interesting to mix these things together, but they really are good together. Trust me, you're going to like this. So how do we make this drink? We start with our shaker full of ice and we're going to pour about a one and a half count of cognac. One and a half. And the same amount of triple sec, which as we all know, tastes like oranges. One and a half. And about the same amount of rum. You can use any kind of rum. I happen to like Bacardi and I have it on hand, so we're gonna use Bacardi. One and, okay. Then you're gonna take about a quarter of an ounce of lemon juice. You can use fresh lemon juice. I don't feel like making fresh lemon juice, so I use this stuff. All right. That's about a quarter ounce. We place our lid on our shaker and then we shake. Oh, do we love to shake. Shake it, shake it, shake it, yes. So we are melding the warm, heavy flavor of the cognac with the light and tropical rum and the orange flavor of the triple sec and the lemon flavor of the juice. When we're done shaking, we take our strainer, or if we do not have a strainer, our slotted spoon. We are then going to strain the drink into our chilled martini glass, or if we do not have a martini glass, like I don't seem to, the closest thing possible that you can find in your house. This is what I have. So let's strain it in here and let's see. Ooh, look at this lovely light color. It's very pretty. Okay, now the garnish for this drink is an orange peel. And the reason for that is of course, to play up the orange flavor in the triple sec. What do we do with a peel? We always run the inside around the rim to get a little bit of extra flavor. And then we squeeze the peel in to get that little bit of oil from the, from the rind into the drink, and we drop it in. As I was saying, this drink was invented in the 1920s. Um, there are several different origin stories, but my favorite origin story is that it was created uh, in a brothel in the 1920s in Paris, and it was an aperitif uh, for the prostitutes. So it was like a before work drink, which is why they called it the between the sheets, I guess, to get them ready to go between the sheets, I don't know. Anyway, uh, that's my favorite one of the stories, so we're gonna go with that one. Let's have a taste. Mm. So good. So what you have is you have, as I've mentioned, this rich under flavor of the cognac. And generally you don't, when you're mixing with fruit juices or fruit flavored liqueurs, you don't want to use a very expensive cognac. In this case, because the taste of the cognac shines through, I would say it's not so bad to invest a little bit of money in the cognac for this drink. So as, as I was saying, you have this rich underbelly of cognac You've got the light tropical rum, you've got the orange and the lemon citrus, and it's just a lovely, lovely flavor. I can see why this cocktail has endured for a hundred years. Ah, drink up, enjoy.